Hello everyone, this is Mark Van de of the Brain Wagon blog. Today I uh, received my very first Gameduino. Uh, Gameduino was a Kickstarter project and uh, it basically consists of a shield that has a small uh, Xilinx FPGA that implements a VGA interface and a sound interface and allows you to program really simple video games using the Arduino. Um, as you can see, it's plugged into a VGA monitor, which is over here. And this is the very first test program that I wrote using, uh, using the game Duino. Um, let's see if I can zoom in a little closer. So you can see that there are little Space Invader dudes moving back and forth. There are actually 32 of them. Uh, the game Duino supports up to 256 sprites. And while these are in black and white, just because uh, I couldn't uh, be spared the brain power to figure out uh, how to colorize them. Um, you can actually have up to 256 colors in each sprite. Each sprite is 16 by 16 and can be moved independently anywhere on the screen. So this is just a few lines of code. Um, I just a few minutes ago got the very first one animating back and forth. And now I have a whole row of them. I could easily do a lot more um, and that would be kind of fun. Um, I'm really impressed by the game Duino. It pretty much works exactly as, as planned. The hardware is a little quirky. The paletting uh, to do color is a little confusing. I have to sit and think about this. It's been a long time since I've done this kind of bitwise twiddling and hacking. But it's a really neat platform, and I urge anybody who got one to play with it. And uh, if you like this, uh, you know, try and uh, get some buzz about it, because it would be great if SparkFun or some other manufacturer decided to start making these because they really are a lot of fun to play with. Anyway, um, I'll have more uh, cool stuff coming on with this, I'm sure, over the next few days and weeks. Uh, but uh, this is just my out-of-the-box test, original code written by Mark Van Wettering of the Brain Wagon blog. Hope you have a good evening, and I'll get the code up uh, sometime when I've tweaked it a little bit more to do something a little more interesting. Have a good one.